We have an update tonight on a church fire from Friday. That fire seriously damaged a congregation celebrating its 90th year on Indy's west side. Well, now there's a community effort to help church members move forward. You're the center of my the power of faith and friendship on full display Sunday at 25th Street Baptist Church. The congregation opening their doors to another local church damaged by fire. When we found out about the fire and that they were going to be displaced, our first response was, what can we do to help? As, and I'm sure if the, if the tables were turned, it would be the same thing extending a hand to us. Very grateful and thankful to uh, 25th Street Baptist Church and Pastor Kenneth Manuel uh, for helping us out uh, today and allowing us to come and worship. The 200 members of Greater Zion Hill Missionary Baptist can no longer worship in their own historic building. Windows and doors boarded up. Friday's fire caused severe smoke and water damage. What sparked it is still unknown. Still, the pastor remains hopeful. Uh, this is just the building. It doesn't stop us from, from doing the work that God's called us to do. That work and their worship is now happening here. That beginning August 9th, we will share our facility with Greater Zion Baptist Church. It was automatic that we would reach out and extend a helping hand to a fellow, to a sister church in need. Two congregations, one mission. We're still on the battlefield and working and serving. Even as they rebuild from tragedy. Next Sunday, Greater Zion will hold services in the parking lot outside their burned building. Then the following week, they'll worship in the 25th Street Baptist Sanctuary once again.